we fight sometimes when I'm like, you know, you're supposed to be this dog rescue. Why aren't we rescuing? And then I end up with 12 puppies and I say, why did you say that, Marisa? She's like, we gotta help this dog. And I'm sitting on the bench while she's, you know, petting the dog and, and sitting on the floor with the dog. And I'm like thinking in my head, we've got this coming up, we need to do this. And I'm trying to like think, was well, this gonna work? Is there any way we can make this work? And she in the meantime, just like, let's save the dog. That's why we're here, let's take the dog. We took her to the vet and they did an X-ray and saw 12 skulls. And we got her home. We have that kennel outside, which is perfect. Set her up, brought the bed out, we were, really prepared for a couple days to kind of get to know her and then she went into labor it seems like she went into labor that night and started having the puppies the next day 18 hours after we pulled her from the shelter we took her out of the shelter so she could have the puppies in a home not in a shelter and then she is going to pibbles and more animal rescue is going to be basically foster for them so that she could have the puppies outside of the shelter. Because the dogs having puppies in the shelter is not the best thing for them. It's really stressful for her, stressful for the puppies. At two weeks, they started opening their eyes and then their ears were all kind of like cauliflower ears at first and then they opened up. And, and now when you turn the light on, they all wake up and play and bark and fight, fight a lot. that they all get good homes and have happy lives and, and I know glad I was know. able to be a part of it. And I do know they'll get great homes just because I know the rest of you are going into to really make sure that so I know they're gonna be happy mm -hmm. dogs they're not gonna be the hopefully yeah. not a shelter again. <laughs> There's tons of applications in on them but Sasha I want to keep Sasha. I want to keep Skip. So we might add two more dogs who knows. That would put us at 10, and I believe that's hoarding. We're not gonna take two dogs. This gives our relationship so much more depth and meaning and to share with someone something you're so passionate about and have them accept it and thrive on it is so rare and so incredible. So we need the dogs. You can never get enough smiles. There's more where that came from. Check out these other videos guaranteed to make you smile. And the smile train doesn't have to stop there. We have new videos every day. Click that nifty little subscribe button so you don't miss a thing.